Hey y'all! Welcome back to my channel and if you are new here my name is Audrey and today I have for y'all another Shein haul. So if you haven't already hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to let you know when I upload a new video and let's go ahead and get started. get started on the clothes I just wanted to tell y'all thank you so much for being patient with me with my uploads and the time in between videos because <laughs> y'all I'm trying to find some kind of balance between my full-time job and this and it gets kind of hard because you know I put a lot of pressure on myself to get the get the videos done and get everything out there to you but some days I am exhausted from work so um i did actually scale back my hours at work because i'm just trying to again find that balance somewhere and so they're working with me a little bit on my hours so hopefully that will give me a little bit more free time to be able to make videos and spend time with y'all because that's what i really 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 want to do so again thank y'all so much for being patient with me in between videos and i I don't think I'll ever have a set schedule on here because I kind of want to keep it light and not so, not as structured, I guess. <laughs> so just bear with me. I'm figuring this whole thing out. So before we talk about the outfits, I wanted to show y'all just a couple of pieces of jewelry that I got from Shein. So everything in this haul I bought myself. Y'all know I love Shein. I've been buying from them for, for a couple years now. Well, some years now so they do send me stuff once a month sometimes twice a month the rest of it I buy myself just because I love it but I wanted to bring y'all this haul because it's just random things that I kind of put together and I always have kind of a running wish list so <laughs> so these are some of the pieces off of that list but I wanted to start with a few accessories just some little jewelry pieces that I picked up because they are just the cutest so i'm gonna start with the one that i have on and it is an origami kitty so y'all know that we have two cats two little rescues that are our little babies and we just love them and when i saw this necklace i thought it was just the sweetest thing so i hope that y'all can see it it's just a little origami kitty cat it's so sweet and this is the necklace on its longest like its last little hole I like longer necklaces I like for them to usually come down to here but I think this is a really pretty length again it is just your costume jewelry I think it costs maybe two dollars maybe a dollar fifty so I did buy two of these and just use that little trick like I told y'all a long time ago get you some Krylon or Rust-Oleum the clear high gloss just gloss that you can in the spray can and just put it out on some aluminum foil spray it let it dry flip it over spray it again and let it dry and it'll keep a lot longer like your stuff will not turn as fast because y'all know costume jewelry tends to turn very very fast <laughs> but I love this little origami kitty I think that she's just the sweetest thing ever and now the other two necklaces that I got, because I love necklaces, I've always loved them. I have another cat one, and I'm going to show this one to you. Hope y'all can see it. It's got a little kitty paw print and a heart. I think that is so sweet. This one has, the, the chain is about the same length as this one. So again, if you like the longer ones, you can always take it off and put it on another necklace. But I just thought that was so, so cute with the little imprint of the paw. Now the last one that I got is a butterfly. I'm going to show you that one. So you've got that white enamel on the top of the wings and you got those little rhinestones here. So this one reminded me of Dolly Parton. As y'all know, I love Dolly and she loves butterflies. So anytime I see anything with butterflies, I try to pick it up. But this little necklace was just so, so cute. I had to have it. Now for the first look in this haul, I have just my basic white bodysuit. You're going to see two more of these in the rest of this haul, but this one y'all have seen a thousand times. 4XL, 100% cotton. Everything will be linked down below, as always, with my coupon code, my measurements. Everything will be there. But this top is an oldie on this channel, but these pants are not, and they are beautiful. Now I went with the 4XL in these, and they are a cotton polyester mix. 
But here's the thing about these. There's, I love these pants. I absolutely love them. So they are a dusty pink and these are part of the Shein and Sarah Ray Vargas collaboration. I do watch her. I don't know why I forgot to mention her name in our get to know me video because I watch just about everything she puts out. But I just, I don't know, it just wasn't on my mind at the time. But these pants, y'all, step back so you can see them. They are a true wide leg pant. They are beautiful. And again, these went up to a 5XL and I was so tempted to get them in the 5XL because I usually get the largest size in their pants, especially ones made like these, just because I don't want it to pull here. But based on the measurements, I went with a 4XL and I'm glad I did because I don't, I don't want them to be too, too big and loose because they're already very flowy. But y'all, the elastic in these pants, I have the belt tied here so I can't pull it all the way. Plenty of room in these pants. They're a heavier weight. I think if you wore black underwear in these, you'd probably see it okay. But it is a thicker material than we're probably used to, so it's not that real thin polyester beautiful but i'm gonna tell y'all something about these pants that make me very very happy now they don't have pockets or anything but i mention a lot on here that shein doesn't put a belt loop in the back in the middle right here and that bugs me to no end because your belt rides up your back it, it just it's just not nothing to connect it so when i got these pants y'all it has belt loops, they're wide. I'm gonna try to show you the belt loop. Here's one of them right here in the front. It's a wide belt loop, but you have one here, 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 and in the middle. So you have five belt loops in these pants. That's unheard of in Shein pants, especially like these, because usually that belt is just flying all over the place. So. I don't know if she had a hand in that or if she made a suggestion to do that, but if she did, thank you so much because that is my biggest pet peeve with a lot of pants that have those self-tie belts. There's nothing to hold it in place in the back. So thank you to whoever came up with that. But y'all, these pants are absolutely beautiful. They're comfortable. They're just gorgeous. You could dress them up or down. Put on a denim shirt with this y'all beautiful and again i am five six and i'm going to tell you it hits the top of my foot but it does drag in the back so i would definitely have to wear some kind of a wedge or heel with these just so that they don't drag on the ground so here is the front and the back I must have been in a mood to buy skirts and tops just because that's what the next three pieces are going to be. They're going to be some tops and skirts mixed. And I just love skirts, but I don't buy them as often just because Shein has a lot of really pretty dresses. And y'all know I am a dress fanatic, just like a lot of y'all are. But sometimes you want separates. So I have this adorable skirt. It is a very simple black skirt, but I'm going to show you the fabric up close. So I went with a 3XL in this one because it does have an elastic band. I'm going to show you that. You got a lot of stretch in this, and it is a cotton polyester mix. So I was able to go with that 3XL without worrying about it being too, too fitted across the belly area. So here is that skirt. Look, it's just your classic roses on a black background it's nothing spectacular but so pretty there is it's just such a classic classic print now i will tell you this one is a little bit thin you can't see right through it but i would say plan on wearing at least some black underwear with this just because it's a little bit thin especially where those roses are so just keep that in mind so i paired it with my favorite bodysuit that she in sells i think i now have every color because they've added a few and you're going to see this one and another one in just a minute so i think i have every color that they have available right now so this one is a 4xl and it's 100 percent cotton so it's just your traditional scoop neck bodysuit i never really wore bodysuits much until like till maybe the last six months or so and i love them because 
Y'all know, like I just showed y'all, I love high-waisted wide leg pants, but I don't want to wear a shirt untucked because the pants are wider and I don't want, you know, I don't want it to swallow me whole. So, I like to wear wide leg loose pants with a fitted bodysuit. So, that's why I have so many of them. But y'all, they work with everything, especially skirts. So, here it is together. So this is the perfect length for a skirt because it's not too long to where it's too modest and everything's all covered up, but I just love this. Again, I am 5'6", and this one goes just below my knee. It's a flat waistband in the front, and then you have that elastic and the pleating in the back. So you have plenty of wiggle room in this one, and I do love the look of this, the silhouette of it with a bodysuit. Just my opinion. So here is the front and the back. And now for the next look. So first, we're going to talk about this shirt really, really quick because it is beautiful, but I sized up worried that it would be too fitted. And I really should have gone with either a 2 or a 3XL. Probably a 2XL because this one's a polyester elastane mid. Definitely could comfortably get a 2XL in this one. And I'm definitely going to be ordering another one because it is adorable. But this one is pretty big. So I left it untucked. I'm going to tuck it in in just a second to give you the effect with another black floral skirt. But I wanted y'all to see... This is the 4XL, and again, should have sized down, lesson learned, but the sleeves, it's just right in here, it's kind of baggy. So I'm not sure if I threw it in the washer and then dried it, if it would shrink a little bit and be a little bit more fitted, but the sleeves are just pretty loose, so it looks a little bit sloppy, and I like a little bit more of a polished look, as y'all know, but just the sleeves are a little bit long, and right in here is loose. So other than that, when I tucked it in for some pictures a little bit ago, it looked fine. And I roll, I pulled the sleeves up. And I could always use my little trick with the hair tie on each side just to hold those sleeves up because they are pretty big and they want to just fall down. So definitely size down in this top if you like it because it is absolutely adorable. It's a beautiful mauve color or dusty pink as they call it. You've got your Peter Pan collar and that really cute little black ribbon here as a bow. I just think it's adorable and the Peter Pan collar is in the back too. So it's just a really cute piece especially to pair with a skirt. So I just wanted to show y'all that it is pretty big for a 4XL on Shein but definitely size down on this one. Now for the skirt that I got to pair this with, y'all, I love floral skirts. And like I said, I must have been in the mood for skirts and tops because <laughs> I've got plenty of them in this haul. But again, a very modest cut to this skirt, but it flows. It's just a pull-on skirt and it's got elastic in the waist. I did go with the 2XL in this one based on the measurements. It's just the slightest bit snug right here, but nothing bad. I can't really, it's just when I was putting it on, I was kind of like, well, I don't know if this is gonna be. <laughs> but once I got about here and it popped into place, it was fine. So again, a 2XL in this one, 100% polyester. And I'm gonna show you the fabric. So it is a black ditzy floral. It's got those really pretty pink flowers all over it with the little leaves. I just love these kind of skirts. I just think they're so pretty. And you can always pair this with a white tee or bodysuit and a denim jacket. Take it back to the 90s a little bit, but this is just such a pretty skirt. I love this and I love the whole look together. I just need to size down on this shirt. So here is the front and the back. And now for the next skirt and bodysuit combo. <laughs> so this one's going to be a little bit matchy-matchy, kind of a monochromatic look. I know that that's not for everybody, but I really like it. I've always liked a few different shades of the same color together. I just think they're so pretty. So I have another bodysuit like the ones that y'all have already seen. <laughs> But this is their dusty blue. I did not have this one. I did buy it for this haul. And because I had never seen this color in them before and it's 
beautiful and I love blue I think blue is just such a pretty color especially this one so I did get this one in the 4XL and it is 100% cotton and it's just like the white one and the black one that y'all have already seen and I have paired it with this skirt y'all <laughs> I love this skirt it is a cotton elastane mix and I went with the 3XL it does have a zipper up the back but I just pulled it right over my head and wiggled it over these parts and then right into place it's very stretchy but it's a heavier weight I wish that y'all could see this it's it almost looks like a t-shirt material but it's not it's really soft but it feels so good on your skin. Like I wish I could just explain it and y'all would know what I'm talking about, but it feels like a heavy weight t-shirt that you've washed a thousand times. It's very soft and it just lays on your body perfectly. I think this is beautiful. And this one is also a dusty blue. So they are technically the same color, but with the material, what it is here, it just looks darker than the top. And I really like that. I think it's very, very pretty. And you have these little ties right here on the side that you can just tie in a little bow. They are attached. But y'all, everything about this look I love. I know that, like I said, I know it may not be for everybody. You could always pair this skirt with that black bodysuit that I just showed y'all. And at first I was gonna do that, but then once this came in, I had to put it together because I just think it's so pretty. So, here is the front and the back. And now on to the dresses. So before I show y'all this beauty, when I when I found this one online, I thought, what do I think I already have this dress? <laughs> y'all, I have so many dresses, you have no idea. But I had just worn it not that long ago, and I was like, am I getting the same dress again? But I, I wasn't sure. So if y'all remember this one, if it's wrinkled, I'm really sorry. I wore it, I think about a week ago, and so it might be a little bit wrinkled. But this dress, y'all loved it because it, I don't know, y'all, it's just, it's just about the same dress. But I love this dress. It just has the bigger buttons. But when I got this one, I really thought that I already had it, but it was actually the more yellow dress. So, please don't think that I got a repeat because I don't. I have this one and I wear it lovingly, but now I have a darker one and this one is longer. So, I'm going to show you this one. So this dress, let me step back because it is beautiful. Look at this dress. I know it kind of matches my painting up here, but y'all, this color is gorgeous. Now I went with the 2XL in this one based on the measurements, and y'all, the fit of this is perfect. So if you're close to my measurements, you can go with that 2XL. You do have a little bit of stretch in this, not a whole, whole lot but this fabric is so thick. It's a polyester elastane mix, but it is such a heavy, heavy fabric. I was trying to iron it. I finally had to just steam it because as I was ironing it, it's so heavy, it just kept pulling it off my ironing board. So, so I just went ahead and steamed it, but y'all, this fabric is gorgeous. Look at, and I mean, the weight of it is amazing. It holds its shape. The color is beautiful. Y'all, the fit of this, I love this dress. You have button front, they are functioning buttons all the way down the front, as you can see. And it does have those beautiful seams, just like the dress that I just talked about. But it just gives you that really pretty shape, a little bit of a vintage vibe because you've got the puff sleeves. But y'all, this dress is a must have. I love this dress especially going into fall. I cannot wait for fall. I know that some of y'all love the summer, but I do not. I'll be honest, I do not. I am a fall and spring person. I am ready. <laughs> I'm tired of the heat. I am done. But y'all, the length of this is beautiful. It is a true midi, so it does hit the lower part of my calf, almost to a maxi, but not quite. This dress is gorgeous absolutely gorgeous get it just go ahead and get it and find somewhere to wear it to later <laughs> so here is the front and the back
And the last piece in this haul is this beautiful dress. When I saw this one, I had to have it because of the colors, because it's got that really pretty mauve pink background with all these pretty flowers on it. So this one, I went with the 3XL, and it is 100% polyester. But y'all, there are so many details in this dress. So the sleeves for one, they're kind of a bishop sleeve, so they're really roomy, and you've got plenty of room to move in these, but then you've got that banded wrist with plenty of elastic in here. I love these sleeves because if I wanted to pull it up, I could, and it'll stay up, so I don't have to worry about it falling on my hand. So you have that really pretty pleating here, almost an empire waist. This one does have a vintage feel to it, the cut of it, because you have that really pretty neckline where the fabric kind of gathers right here. And then you've got that pleating here and that empire waist. Not a whole lot of stretch in this. Again, I went with the 3XL and there's not much wiggle room in this waist. So it just fits me. The top fits perfectly, I mean, perfect the shoulders across the bust the back it is so comfortable and just perfect and it still fits right here but it fits so <laughs> so if you're not sure about the sizing and the waist is just a little bit tight in the 3xl for you i would say go up if it is a little bit too big after you get it you could always wear a belt with it and it'll be fine and as for the skirt, y'all, it's so pretty. And again, I am 5'6", and this one hits right at my knee. So not too short. It's the perfect length, especially for this style. It's very, very classic and so pretty. I am in love with this dress. Oh, and I wanted to show y'all the fabric up close so you can see these really pretty flowers. Look at those flowers. <laughs> it is so pretty. It almost looks hand painted, but you've got every color you can think of, but that really pretty background is just absolutely gorgeous. I love this dress. I think it's one of the prettiest dresses that I own now, so highly recommend this one. Completely in love. So, here is the front and the back. And that is all I have in this haul today. And I hope that y'all like some of these pieces because I know I did, especially this kitty necklace. I just love it. I cannot stop looking at it. It's so, so pretty. But y'all, thank you so much for spending your time with me. And I will try to not let as much time pass between videos. I have quite a bit of stuff to show y'all. And I'm really excited for all those pieces because I have a more of a vintage style haul coming up. I know I had somebody ask a few days ago where I'll, where my vintage stuff was. <laughs> so it's coming, so I just got to work on it. But y'all, thank you so, so much for being here. And I really do appreciate every single one of y'all. So until next time, y'all take care of yourselves and take care of each other. And I will see you soon.